Scholar, welcome out to you, Spring Gaming. My name is Bueller, sending in photos. Jason Scholar from the Pembroke, New Hampshire area, taking a look at the rainfall and mixed with frozen precipitation here on April 26, 2016. We're looking at ice pellets mixing in with the rainfall here across this portion of southern New Hampshire. And as you can see, temperatures were cold enough, about 35 degrees as that colder column of air it, as the precipitation fell into it, it had an adiabatic cooling and we were able to cool that column down to the surface. And that is where we've got the frozen precipitation mixing in with the rainfall. So we got some of those ice pellets as well as snowfall as well mixing in. So it's been a very cold April here across the Northeast. Hopefully things will slowly warm up here into May, but it's been very unusually troughy here in the Northeast, especially with that stationary front setting up bisecting spring versus winter. So thank you, Jason Scholler, for sending those in. And we take a look at the forecast here, uh, rainfall across the nation. Lots of rainfall out west here with the trough, a low pressure, but your attention draws to the east side of the trough here. This is where we're going to be seeing a tremendous amount of rainfall, especially northeast Texas, southeast Oklahoma, southwestern Arkansas. We could see up to 7 to 12 inches of rain. This is not very good news, especially areas of Texas that have been flooded recently. And we're going to see tornadoes, damaging wind, large hail, all likely over the next five days, stretching across the plains, even up into Kansas, Nebraska here, another five to eight inches of rain stretching east here. We got storminess here in the east as well. Taking a look at the trough out west, it's on the east side of this trough. Yes, you will get plenty of rain out west here, but it's the east side of the trough here. So we get a series of systems ejecting out into the central plains. Taking a look at Wednesday here across the northeast. Of course, Wednesday not looking too bad. Oh, we've got the system moving out of the region Cooler temperatures in the wake, mostly into the upper 40s, lower 50s here across the northeast from the thruway on northward. Warmer here to the south, Susquehanna River Valley into Thursday. We've got an advancing warm front. That system, that front is pushing back to the north here, and rain will develop across Pennsylvania, portions of West Virginia, Ohio, Maryland, and Northern Virginia. And that will translate to slightly warmer temperatures into your Friday. We've got some of that sliding off to the east here, but we got another ripple of low pressure developing here. And we'll have some scattered showers here, upper Susquehanna River Valley, Catskills, Poconos, and the southern Adirondacks westward to the lower Great Lakes. We're still seeing mostly sunny here for the most part here across northern New England and southeast Canada. Heading on into your, uh, basically the weekend. We start off the weekend here. Uh, things not looking too bad here. We're starting to push that front a little bit further to the south. Again, we're breaking into 60s here across the northeast, and we will have some spritzels of rain here suppressed a little bit further to the south, but sun really breaking out here across the lower Great Lakes. In 10 seconds, I'll have a five-day outlook for my hometown viewers from Binghamton to Scranton, Upper Susquehanna region of upstate New York and northeast Pennsylvania. Don't forget to like me on Facebook and Mark. Subscribe to me on YouTube and Mark.com. It's Twitter, WX Northeastern, Google Plus, and Mark. Here's your five-day. Wednesday through the weekend, taking a look at some very nice weather here across the northeast. Not too bad here, for, cool for your Wednesday, only into the 50s, but Thursday warming up a little bit. Rain developing, scattered showers and rain into your Friday as well. Continuing with those scattered showers, possibly rain, especially south of the New York Pennsylvania border. Temperatures are getting up towards the 60, upper 50s, lower 60s, and it's Saturday as well, breaking out that sun, so enjoy the weekend. That's going to do it for this edition of Weather Northeastern. <music>